Hi, my name's Patrick, the Free Will Baptist, and thank you again for joining me for another of my Once Saved, Always Saved study moments. <clears throat> now, I want to go ahead and open by addressing that I believe a person is saved by their faith or their belief in Jesus Christ, just as John 3.36 plainly teaches. Today, I want to, or in this segment, I want us to open up and examine what Jude verses 3 and 3 through 5 say. Beloved, when I gave all diligence to write unto you of the common salvation, it was needful for me to write unto you and exhort you that you should earnestly contend for the faith which was once delivered unto the saints. For there are certain men crept in unawares who were of, before of old ordained to this condemnation, ungodly men, turning the grace of our God into lasciviousness and denying the only Lord and our Lord Jesus Christ. I will therefore put you in remembrance that you once knew, knew this, how the Lord, having saved the people out of the land of Egypt, after, afterward destroyed them that believed not. So, let's go on how I've been addressing in my previous videos about denying the Lord Jesus. You're going to hear me talk about this a whole lot because I've heard people that say that they believe in once saved and that they're saved. They also turn around and tell me that they can deny the Lord Jesus openly to other people, but yet, while they're doing that, that they're still actually saved. That's not what the Bible teaches, and, that, and I don't believe a lick of that. So, I want you to listen here closely. In verse number 4, it says, There's ungodly men that turn grace of God into lasciviousness, and denying the only Lord and our Lord Jesus Christ. Now, what does it say there? It doesn't say that denying the Lord is something that you're supposed to do. It says that people that are turning grace into lasciviousness, they believe that in denying Lord Jesus and that they're still saved. And now he went on to say that he'd put them in remembrance that you knew once how the Lord had saved the people out of the land of Egypt and afterward destroyed them that believed not. So you go read very, very closely, and you'll find out that if you start believing and you don't finish believing, you will not go to heaven. You must continue to believe and have faith and profess Jesus Christ throughout your whole life. If you've denied Lord Jesus, the scriptures teach that you're an antichrist. It doesn't teach that a person that denies the Lord is a saved individual. Personally to me, if you're actually saved, why would you want to deny your first love, Lord Jesus? The one that saved you from the depths of hell and all your misery here on earth even. Thank you for your time. Thank you for watching my video. I hope you have a good blessed day. God bless in only Lord Jesus Christ's precious name.